Hi there guys, I'm Chris Bowden and you're not. And I'm Paul Kidwell. Welcome to the Geek Group. Once again deep under Cayenne Mountain in our super secret workshop where we are modifying Nerf guns. What's the yes. gun of the day, sir? The gun of the day? It's brand new. It is a clear recon CS6. Cool. All right. Now, what we're doing is we're modifying this gun so that it will shoot way, way harder. And the cool thing is, our mod, which is the Kidwell mod, that's what we're calling it, because it was invented it was mine. Yeah. By, by my funk soul brother here, who uh, came up with a system to modify Nerf guns yeah. here that it doesn't require dismantling the gun. And it only requires like a $2 piece of pipe from the hardware store. It's really easy. So what you're going to need to do this is a coat hanger, your trusty Gerber, and a piece of uh, copper pipe with a one half inch outside diameter. Okay, because it's easy to tell. Just go to the hardware store, take a dart with you. There's your dart. There's your piece of copper pipe, and you'll notice they're the same size. See? So. Take your dart with you to the hardware store. You don't need a lot. You only need a piece of pipe that long. That's all you need. You don't need like 10 foot of it. So if they sell, you know, it's called drops. If they sell little drop pieces, then buy that. So take your gun out of the package. And this is the Recon CS6. It just came out. Yeah, the clear version. A couple version months ago. Yeah, the clear out. version just came out. It's got the tactical light, Mr. Kidwell. It's yeah. a tactical light or a red dot sight, depending on how you move it back and forth. I want to put okay. this on my bell just to get the works at the range. All right. Okay, <laughs> there's our part. All right, so there's the thing. All right, now, now do I'm we want to... We can just do it right off this. We can do it right off Shall this. Shall we do the before and after comparison? Okay, um, yeah, we should. All right. Well, with nothing in... And this one, you can see all the guts on it. Yeah, nice that's, that's kind of cool. Mean. It's the first clear yeah. gun we've done. Oh, man, that is so weird. It won't be the like you can see this. You can see this slide thing real clear. Here, I'll get stuff out of the way. Go ahead. Yeah, it's really slow. You can do a side by side too because mine's not mine. Okay. Oh yeah, one more down here. But okay, so, so here's our here's our here's before. See how slow that moves over there? It's it may seem fast right now if, if you're not familiar with modded nurse, but that's really, really slow. And what it is is that compressed spring is moving the plunger down. Here you go, watch. Okay, that's before. Now, let's make after. Okay, now, again, we have the same sort of thing where you got that tube and you got that seam right there. The insides of these guns are all the same. Yeah. So, uh, the outside of them are pretty interchangeable. Like, I can take this and put it on the big sniper rifle and stuff. All the, the parts are modular. It's really cool. It's, it's actually a really good design. Yeah, it's, it's, very, it's very modular. All right. So, I love it. So, you want me to get on drill? Yeah, you get on drill. Let's move around here. Okay, we got our we got our coat hanger for the little bit if it gets stuck in there again. Okay, ready to go. All the little bits. Here, let's we'll do it right over there so they can see it going in. That'll be cool. With the clear gun, it should look kind of neat. Well, no, the tube is the tube is opaque. Oh, the tube itself. Okay. Yes, and this one I got. I'm going to have to hold here. Okay, you got it. Here, let's let's get on the camera. Though. Okay, hold on. Well, wait a minute. There, back off. Back up a little. There you can see I'm going into there. Ready? Ready when you are. Okay, there's the first, first shot. Shot. And yeah, you got stuff in there. Now you'll you'll feel it as you're going through. That's not it'll, long enough. It'll hit in steps. It's not quite long enough, no. Yeah, we should um, I shouldn't, well, there's other pieces of that. You want to grab them and poke? I don't I don't have everything, Paul. You don't have everything? I don't, I don't have everything, because that's going to right out. All right. That's okay. all I got. We got the first. Well, we're through the first layer. All right. You'll feel, as you go through, you'll, oh, yeah. feel, it, okay. you'll feel it give, and it'll, it'll just jump forward as you get through different layers. You want okay. to stop every time it every Okay, time there you can jump. see the line. So we're not down to the line like we were before. Yep, yep. We're yeah, almost there. Right you ready? There. Go for it. Oh, this is great because you can see the line. Oh, there's the first bit. Okay. Uh, it's still in I'm here. Empty. It didn't come out this time. All right. Well, just keep going. Ready? Okay, go.
Oh, it got a little bit more. I felt it. There. Now we got it. Okay, yeah, there's it, stuff it in falls there. falls right through. Okay. There's and that here's, piece. here's the guts. Okay, and I can see the next piece floating around in there. Okay, here, just see if you can pull it right up. Give my chair back. Here, get, get, get over okay, there. Okay. Get over there. All right, so here's after. <laughs> it's violent. Okay. Ah, oh, it's so vicious. The only, the, only, the only wrinkle we had is we got the piece in the middle, and even if even if that happened, normally you'd have to take the gun apart anyway. Yeah. So even if we had to take this apart, I mean. But, but you can just fish we, it out. That's I fished what it out. For. We got it fished there's, out. There's there's still some. Here. There's a piece in there. Let me see the coat hanger. I okay. Start, I got I got one piece left down in there. I got a ring. Right oh, there. there you go. Yep. All right. Get and all the bits out. Yeah, you want to get all the bits out. And there's there's take your time when you drill it out. Go nice and slow. Don't ram it in. Let it. it it's more of a melt than a cut, really. So take your time and do it, but look at that, five minutes and, and just boom, it takes no time at all to get this all squared away. And here, we'll compare it against Corey's. Corey's talking to your gun. I don't need the whole thing. Oh, shut up, you got it. Big dork weapon here. Mm -hmm. All right, here, I need, a, I need a couple darts. I need some ammunition. Oh, that'll work. All right, thank you, sir. Now. Modified? Modified. Okay. Here's Corey's. Here's no, here, the stock. Modified. Wow. Oh. See, works great. <laughs> <laughs> so here you go. Stock one. Modified. Definitely snappier. Yes. Shoots about 25% farther, really. I mean, it's, it's good. We need to go it's outside nice and do and some snappy. range testing. Yeah, we'll do some range testing with them now. But yeah, we want to thank you guys for watching. I'm Chris Bowden. And I'm Paul Kidwell. We're with the Geek Group. If you want to tinker and work on tools and toys and making, you know, fun mods to all your stuff, go to thegeekgroup.org. You should be a member. If you're watching this video and you're playing with this kind of stuff, you definitely should be a member. Mm -hmm. So check us out, thegeekgroup.org. This video was made possible by the other cool dorky guys over at, where'd you put them all? You moved them on Over me. here. Over at Amazing Magnets where you can get really fun stuff like this and make buckyballs. And you can learn all about Amazing Magnets and their cool kits at amazingmagnets.com. And you can check out thegeekgroup.org where we have all kinds of ideas on cool things to build out of this, like this super amazing buckyball. My buckyball. It's, you, you gotta think for that. Yeah. Precious. Precious. You guys have fun. We'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye-bye. This video was made possible by a grant from the Future Girl Foundation. This video was made possible by thousands of private donations from members and viewers like you. Please visit thegeekgroup.org for more information on how you can donate and become a part of our dreams of Avalon.